pray I have done it today. I woke up at like, like what, eight? Playing this. Now it is 11 o'clock at night. Still playing it. Full day of the show. Might be my last game. Chris Sale on the mound. We're going to see if Chris Sale is back. He struggled tremendously mightily, baby. Come on, Chris. Let's end it on a good note, baby. Let me get some sleep. Hope I sleep well tonight. My whole, like, everything just depends on my sleep. Like, when I'm in a bad mood on here, like, going off, going ballistic, that means I ain't getting no sleep. When I sleep well, man, I am just jolly. Having fun, doing voices. That's how you know I'm in a good mood when I'm, like, doing the voices and shit. But when I'm not in a good I'm just talking like this. I just feel, like, ready for bed all the time. When I'm sleep-deprived. Um, like, why, uh... Damn, why are we so um, out of energy and they're just fully rest? We get destroyed. What's the play ball? He safe. All right, one all by right. Who is that? Austin Riley. Let's Anybody go. Ball four. Four. Three. All right, who's that? Willie. Yeah, buddy. Let's sack or run him over. Now you sack fly. 2 0. What it didn't work? What happened? Oh, there was two outs? Oh my freaking God. Oh, okay, that won't happen again. I'm just, what the fuck? No, I did I just do what I think I just did. And I just sack fly with two. Oh my, I feel so stupid. I try to avoid mistakes like that. Because I'm a YouTuber. And everything I do is is recorded. Three. I try to be hit my very best. Three. So I'm do some stupid shit. I did. I Man, bro, come on, Chris. Three, Bear down, Chris. Three. Bear down, Chris. Thank you. We need more runs. Three, three. I don't feel good about this. I shouldn't feel fear when I have a 99 overall pitcher on the mound. He's 36. Ow, ow. What the fuck? That hit him. First I hate this game, Be dude. Safe. But I was I don't think he's playing it. Pull four. Take your base. All right. Yes, double play. I think Chris Hell may be back. Our offense definitely isn't. He safe. Ball four, take your base. Mike, why do I call it? Why am I calling everybody Mike? What the fuck is that? It's not even close to his name. Ronald. Three. Oh, man, Mike. What is wrong? Mike. I called Max Reed Mike the other day. Is there a Mike on this team? Okay. Mike, maybe Michael King. All right. Um, let's get serious. Suarez, righty, righty, lefty, lefty. Um, damn, why is everybody so tired? What is going on? Joey Miz is always. Set your base, ball four. And then he does this, bro. Oh my God! I don't know how he got out of that, but I couldn't even watch. Now pitching for. I'm gonna have to go in with a one nothing lead. Ryan Thompson. Oh my God. Okay. Weaver is eight for eight on saves. Eight innings, eight strikeouts, eight saves, eight games. A lot of eights. Crazy eights. One ball, two strikes. Come on, Weave. His nickname is Bob. Luke Bob Weaver. Get it. Bob and a Weaver. Like boxing. I used to like boxing. I don't like boxing anymore. That's a ball. Bro, that is a strike. I don't understand how boxing's legal. I mean, I understand, like, I looked up why it's legal because of consent. I like, use side forms and whatnot, but you're literally just damaging your brain. I don't like the idea of that. I don't watch football anymore. It's just brain damage. Like the way it goes, you know, like a four percent chance CTE playing like Pop Warner and Little League or whatever. Uh, I believe seventy percent in uh, high school, ninety percent in college, hundred percent CTE rate in uh, NFL. Like, well, I don't want to watch that. It's fucked up. Ah, 
I understand it's fun. I used to love football. I rather just watch something like this, where guys aren't bashing their heads against the brick wall they ever played, basically. I just don't love football the way I used to. Damn, man! This dude's stuff is crazy. Like, I'm not even talking about what Weave is doing. Holy shit, he's incredible! Nine games, nine saves. I think he's over nine strikeouts, though. <laughs> Holy shit. Good way to end the night. Ain't nothing like those one or nothing wins. Never forget. The final is what I leave you with. The final game at Turner Field against Detroit was one to nothing. How fucking fitting was that? I missed Tim Turner Field. The tad, baby. All right, I love you. Well... I do love you, but let's see if we want to look at something. I just did a recap, but I'm so upset as a team. I'm just engaged. I like this a lot. I might be able to sleep tonight. Like, if I can't sleep tonight, it's because I'm just thinking about this. There's a lot of the numbers and shit running through my head. Oh, we've hit our stride. We're 21 and 10 now. We're going to take off like a fucking rocket. I got a decision to make about Buxton. I don't think he can be my two hitter anymore. It's either going to be Olsen or LB. We'll move Olsen back down to four. LB to second. Byron to fifth. I well, nah, I think we're going to do this, actually. Uh, I can't decide about, I want to say third. I like that. Uh, Bucky, uh, Adamus. Man, what is going on with this guy? Like, what is going on? At 30 home runs last year, is one in 30 games. Is he ever going to break out? What the fuck happened to him? Got Space Jam. A Rosa Reina's bad. Everybody that signed those damn extensions ain't doing shit. I'm glad they're not like crazy money. Oh, man, if I sign with it like 30 mil a year, I'll be going ballistic. I'll be panicking. The whole bottom of the line is a fucking hole. What the fuck? Man, we got some things to address. This seems 21 and 10, but it's not good. Like we, I see a lot of problems. A lot of problems. We're going to solve those problems tomorrow. Somehow, some way. But the brain juices ain't, ain't flowing enough tonight to solve. But we will solve them tomorrow in the morning when I wake up and have my coffee. We're going to solve these problems. He's so bad. Like, even his last two starts have been great. He gave up no runs and one run. And his area is still 360. He is so fucking horrible. After winning the Cy Young, he's gonna be like this in real life. Watch, he's gonna fucking implode. There's no way he can keep this up. At his age, there's no fucking way. I know it's coming, and it might be a dark season for us if we have those injuries again. Because it looks like the Braves are shopping in the bargain bin, and that doesn't bode well for us. Look, like we're gonna have fucking RC at shortstop again. I don't want to watch that. I want Adamas. Tired of this cheap ass shit. I'm tired of fucking watching the Dodgers sign everybody. And we can't even retaliate. He is fucking old. On this game, I can retaliate. AA chose to be cheap. He chose that. He said he's never been told no when he asked for money from the uh, from the, the suits. They didn't ask for fucking money to sign Snell or something. Like, you wouldn't have to give him $182 million because it's not L.A. It's Georgia. They have no income tax. You could have gave him 150. Like I get tired of shit like this. And we're going to lose Max Free too? Like, you could have a team like this. Why would you want to give Max Freed away? So stupid. Cheap. But we're not cheap. We got budget room. We're not going to be able to trade for Crochet like I want to. But we're going to trade for somebody. Tomorrow. All right. Thanks for joining me. Braves 2110. Love you. Good night. God bless.